Let's see what's the latest of the UK general election Labour wins the UK general election in landslide. Keir Starmer will be the new Prime Minister. It is after 14 years the Conservatives lose power in a catastrophic defeat that set for the worst results in their history. Change begins now, Starmer says. Rishi Sunak says Britain has delivered a sovereign verdict. The LAB Dems make huge gains while this SNP lose dozens of seats. High profile conservative casualties can include Prime Minister Lee Strauss, Defence Secretary Grand Shapps, Jack. Of Rees, Morgan, Penny Mordaunt. Reform UK leader Nigel Farage becomes an MP as the party meets four MPs. The Greens are also on four in the best election performance yet. With only a handful of seats left to declare his where things stand, he says he's won by party in the UK Labour Party 411 seats. Change that is plus 210, Conservative 119, Liberal Democrat 71, SNP 9, Sinn Fein 7, Independent 6, DUP 5, Green Parties 4, Reform UK 4, Plate Chimbru 4, SDLP. Here you see two Alliance 1, TUD, TUV 1, UEP 1. So here you see it has been a record breaking night for the Liberal Democrats as they smash through conservative heartlands, taking the seats of two former Prime Ministers, Davis Cameron and Theresa May, symbolic victories that demonstrate the late deaths of dissatisfaction among long standing conservative voters. Their success relied on the crumbling conservative vote, but it is also a victory of their own. The victification of the status of the party has pursued with this since well before the election was called. This news from BBC. Please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.